Hi, my name is Noreen Harawa and this is my third painting video. I'm going to paint a moonlight landscape and specifically it's going to be a moonlit lake. I hope you guys are going to enjoy it and please paint along with me. Thank you. As I said, I'm going to be painting a moonlight uh, landscape uh, and it's going to be a moonlit uh, lake. On my palette, I have uh, titanium white, Prussian blue, ivory black, and cadmium red medium. So only those four colors, these are the colors that I'm going to use. Again, I'm using um, water mixable oils. In terms of brushes, I'll be using a flat one inch brush, a bristle filbert brush, another uh, filbert brush, uh, but smaller one, a fan brush, a small fan brush, and a liner brush. Okay, I'm going to start with the sky. Um, it's a night sky, so it's going to be a uh, dark blue, um, um, very dark uh, blue color. And with that, I'll be using uh, Prussian blue and uh, adding a little bit of uh, ivory black and uh, a little bit of red. So Prussian blue ivory black and red okay so Sorry, the top is going to be very dark. Again, this is Prussian blue. A bit of uh, cadmium red. And ivory black. Making it nice and smooth, getting rid of the brush strokes. Okay, uh, my horizon is going to be about here, and as I go down to the horizon, I will add um, some white, titanium white. Again, I'm using these X strokes of the ten and white. Just again, smoothening, making sure it's nice and smooth.
Okay, so this is my sky. And now I'm going to add uh, the moon. Now my moon is going to be about here. So that's where I'll add the moon. I'm going to start by just adding white and blue, the depression blue and white. So I said my moon is going to be here. So this is where it's going to be. Okay, just tighten here. Just blending it nicely. Okay, and to that, um, to create the moon, I'm using the filbert brush and titanium white so it's titanium white so I'm gonna create the moon by just pressing and then twisting the brush pressing and then I'm going to twist that brush twisting it twisting it until it creates a nice round shape okay and then just come back and refine it so I'm coming back and refining it okay okay so that's my moon okay and then I'm also gonna add some stars um, and I'm gonna use a very fine liner brush to add the stars and with that I'm just using titanium white and I'm rolling my fine liner brush making it even more finer and then I'm gonna add some stars and you can put them in any way you want I think there's several ways of creating stars you can also use your filbert brush and just flick flick it on the canvas and you get this splatter of, of paint and that creates the, uh, the stars but I'm using my fine liner brush But again, you can also, you know, there are several ways of, uh, of creating stars. Okay. 
and I'm just putting them you know, wherever I, I want actually and you can do the same so we have our stars okay so we now have some stars Show whether you can see them. Yeah. So there's my stars. Okay. And now I'm going to add some bushes. And for that, I'm going to use my filbert brush. And using the um, the dark blue color uh, which is the Prussian blue plus ivory ivory black that's what I'm gonna use to um, for the bushes that's what I'm gonna use so I'm using the filter brush and I'm just tapping into the paint and creating I'm opening the bristles so that I'm able to create uh, foliage. Okay, so I'm gonna put bushes across. Um, so I just, ooh, I think there's too much water. So just bear with me that I put too much water here. So. And as I said, these are water mixable colors. Um, so you can use water, but not as much as I did, so I'm just fixing. Okay, so again I'm using the filbert brush and opening the, tapping into the paint and opening the bristles. Then I'll just go across creating some bushes, so it's tap, just tapping across. Again, don't make them the same size, just going up and down, up and down. And tap, 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 creating nice bushes. Okay. Okay, and I'm just gonna make them more realistic by using my fan brush and just create some nice leaves. So I'm just coming back and just try to make them look more realistic. And I'm using this small fan brush and just tapping adding some foliage Okay, so these are our bushes, and I'm going to highlight the um, the bushes that are close to the moon. In fact, the ones that are directly under the the moonlight. So for highlight um, for highlighting them, I'm going to use just the uh, blue and white um, so just mixing the Prussian blue and the titan titanium white and a bit of red I guess um, so that's what I'm gonna use 
for for highlighting okay so I'm using again my fan brush just the corner of the brush I'm going to just highlight these ones okay once that I just uh, uh, below the the moon okay so that's what I've done and now the next thing to do is I'm gonna add some water and as you know um, water just reflects uh, whatever colors are in the sky so I'm going to use the same colors that I used in the sky um, I'm gonna reflect those in the water so I'm gonna start with the, the lighter color Okay, so just the, the white and and blue. I'll add the um, just the Prussian blue and then the dark blue at the bottom. Okay, so we, now we add the dark blue. water this is too dry Again, I'm just putting the same colors that are in the sky. So for the dark, it's going to be just the Prussian blue and ivory black. do the bottom um, okay so
to make this smooth. Okay, so that's my water. Okay, now I'm gonna put some reflections of the of the bushes, um, and I'm gonna just use the filbert brush that I used earlier on. use that to you know reflect the the bushes and to do that I'm just gonna pull this down Again, I'm using my filbert brush and just pulling down. Okay, so I've pulled them down as you can see, and then I'm just taking this and then drag right then just across. very lightly gently across okay again just gently across Okay, so we have our reflections. The next thing to do now is I'm going to also reflect the, um, actually before I do that, I'm just going to um, put, uh, um, I mean, try to show where the water um and the bushes i mean where the bushes end and where the water starts um and for that i will use one of the uh palette knives this type of knife and using the the white titanium white and a little bit of blue and i'll just pull and cut across so I have a little bit of paint, I don't know whether you can see it, but it's at, at the edge of the palette knife. And then with that, I'll go across and indicate where I want my water to, to show. So I'm just going across and putting, okay. So it's again pull and cut. I'll do the same this side and just showing. Where the water end. I mean the water line. That's what I'm doing, just putting the water line. Okay. Okay, 
So I've done that. I don't know whether you can see that. Um, it's clear. See now I have the my water line. Okay. Now, as I was saying, I'm also going to reflect the the moon um, in the water. Let me fix this so that it's steady before I do that. So I'm gonna also reflect the moon, uh, and I'm gonna use the uh, first uh, the the paint I'm going to use is a mixture of just the, the blue and white and I'll then come back and highlight that and using my fan brush um, I will put the uh, the reflection of the moon um, and just using the corner of the brush so I'm starting with just the blue and white and I'm going to so let me just make sure it's straight. Okay, so I'm gonna put my moon here and I'm just putting just touch touch using just the, the cor corner of the the fan brush. Okay. Just tap, 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 indicating the reflections. Okay, then I'll come back with just white. Um, Again, using the same fan brush, just the corner of the brush. Uh, this time is just straight white, and I seem to have run out of it, and I'll just add some white. So this is just straight titanium white. of the fan brush okay just the corner I'm coming back and this is straight titanium and just gonna put some more highlight just showing the reflection of the moon done that uh, and I'll show you how it looks like okay so there's my you know moon reflection okay now I'm going to add some grass uh, on this side and uh, you know and perhaps a, a tree so but to start with I'll add some grass and with that I'll just use the same color that I used for the bushes. Um, that's what I'll uh, start with, and then I'll highlight the grass. Um, so, for the grass, I'm going to be using the liner brush. Again, using the same color that I used for the bushes. That's what I'll use to create the grass. And I'm rolling my liner brush in the paint and then using the upward strokes just to create the you know the long long grass so it's just gonna be a 
upward strokes creating some long grass I don't know whether you can see but maybe I'll show you show you later so this is the dark color I'm using which is the same color that I used for the bushes so it's ivory black, Prussian blue, and a uh, little bit of red. Just creating some brush strokes, I mean some uh, upward strokes. And creating some grass. okay and then um, as you can see and then i'm coming back and highlighting this and with that i'm just using the same um, color i've been using for highlighting the bushes so i'm using that okay, okay so i'm just coming back and now adding the the highlight again it's just this upward strokes so you see I've put some highlights and then I'm gonna uh, put a tree as well um, just to make it more exciting and for that again using the same dark color and using my liner brush I'm just gonna put a tree here so I'm just going to put a tree Just drawing my brush as well. then rolling my brush so that I create fine up branches okay so I'm gonna add some branches now just wiggling my brush just creating some nice branches
so I've created my my tree and it's a dry one doesn't have any leaves and I'm going to highlight uh, this tree especially the right side uh, where the moon is as well uh, I mean um, the moon is shining from the right so um, highlight that side and I'm again I'm just going to use the the blue and white uh, mixture to to do the highlighting Just gonna be a few branches. Okay, I'm just gonna add a bit more grass. Especially at the bottom of it, uh, the tree. Okay. I'm adding some more strokes. I'm using my liner brush. we are done um, and I will sign my name and also show you how it looks like um, actually let me show you first you know how it looks like so here is our moonlight landscape our you know our moon lit lake see there it is Okay, and I'm gonna sign my name now. And I'll, I think I'll do it in red, just to give it some color. I'm just signing my name in red. Okay, done. Let me show you how it looks like. Uh, okay, there is our moonscape or moonlightscape. Okay. Right, I hope you've enjoyed it and I hope you guys were painting along with me. Um, so please don't forget to uh, like, uh, comment and also to subscribe. Uh, this is a very easy painting and um, I hope you guys uh, will be able to try it. Uh, it's very easy and you saw I only used a few colors um, and uh, it's pretty easy. Thank you.
and I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks. Bye.